everybody. Vic Lost the Mad here. Uh, this is my second video that I'm putting up today and for this week. And in this one, I'm going to talk about a few things. Um, things that are going on with the channel right now. Plans for expansion of content for the channel. And just some general other things. Uh, little points that I want to get across. So, first we're going to start with things that are going on with the channel right now. Last week's video, um, For the Fatherland, was flagged for a, uh, uh, a copyright tag on a piece of music that was used in the background. Now, that piece of music was written in about 1820 by the German Kaiser at the time, uh, Frederick III, I think. And uh, according to European Union copyright laws, any piece of music uh, there is considered to have gone into uh, their version of public domain after about, I think it was 70 years after the death of the composer. Um, I don't believe then that this piece of music is eligible for copyright. However, Universal Music Group, um, one minute and 40-some seconds after I uploaded the video, had copyright tagged uh, my video, which disabled it for view in Germany and disabled monetization on the video. Now, at first I thought this was just, you know, some kind of automatic tagging system error or something like that, and I wasn't too far off. What it actually turns out is there is no person behind the controls at YouTube any longer. It's all an automated system, and the automated system is extremely flawed. As it turns out, there are other YouTubers who are getting copyright tags on things that they have full permission to use, whether it be something that's in the public domain or something that they have gotten permission from the source to use in their uh, material. I'll give you an example, and this is how I found out about this. Um, I'm a, a follower of Channel Awesome, where one of the things, one of the series that they uh, produce is Nostalgia Critic. Uh, Doug Walker is a, a very funny guy and uh, puts an interesting view on a lot of uh, movies and TV and other things that are usually considered uh, classics um, or, or well-received. Um, all of his points are extremely valid and he presents everything in a very entertaining manner. But Doug put out a video uh, for Channel Awesome at the end of January, and I'm going to put a link to that video uh, down in the description, explaining that they, Channel Awesome, got a copyright tag for material that they had specific permission to use, and uh, he goes into detail on that. And it took them something like three weeks to hear anything back. Dis uh, monetization was completely disabled for their channel. And they were not able to receive any kind of income for anything that they were doing at that time. Um, anything that they put up past that point, anything that they already had put up, all monetization was completely and utterly stopped. So they were not making any income off of it. And it turns out they weren't the only ones. There was a laundry list of people that we're having the same issue. So this is a widespread problem, and now it seems that it's hit me as well. Monetization was disabled for that video just because it's blocked in Germany, and I'm absolutely certain that the copyright tag is incorrect. So until this is resolved, I'm not going to put any more background music on any of my videos. All you're going to hear is very faintly in the background you're going to hear the actual replay sounds and you're going to hear me talking over that and that's all it's going to be until this is taken care of this is not something that's just affecting people who are trying to make money by doing vid videos on youtube um, this affects everyone um, it's affecting long time professional youtubers who have been doing this for years and have not had this kind of trouble ever before it's affecting YouTubers who are just starting out, like myself, in much the same way, and it's also affecting just casual people who are placing things like home videos of like their kid's birthday or something like that up, and there may be, uh, during like a birthday party video, there may be some kind of music playing in the background, um, and even if that music is public domain, it, it could still get an erroneous copyright tag and 
the channel can be, the video can be deleted their entire channel can be completely deleted and there's no explanation for what's going on uh, but again watch Doug Walker's video he goes way into detail about that so I'm not going to go into detail on it here just go watch that second thing I want to go into is the future of content for this channel obviously everything seems to be very focused on world of tanks right now i mean as a matter of fact while you're listening to this you're seeing world of tanks uh replays going on in the background these were video these were replays that i wasn't sure exactly how i wanted to go about presenting them but they were somewhat interesting so i decided they look good for for background content uh, that way you're not just looking in a black space and listening to me talk one of the things uh, that i'm looking at as putting as additional content for the channel is I play a lot of Minecraft and I play primarily on a, uh, a closed realm with a lot of friends of mine locally and we're getting ready to go into our third world on the realm and when that starts when that third world starts I'm, I'll, I'm going to start recording some of the things that I go into there, some of the projects, like build projects, redstone projects, just things that I'm doing. It's a vanilla survival world. There's nothing special about it, but I just want you to see the kind of things that I do while wandering around in the world of blocks. And you are also going to see some of the other people that play on the, the realm with us uh, that I interact with on a regular basis. Now, when it comes to going back to World of Tanks, there are two days out of the week that I cannot do anything with World of Tanks. Uh, those are Saturday and Sunday. And this, this has a point. On Saturdays, I run a Pathfinder game up at the local toy and game store. On Sundays, I play in alternating Pathfinder games. So what I'm planning on doing is tomorrow, I get to sit down with, the, with some of the people that I play these games with, and I'm going to talk to them about the possibility of recording some of the Saturday sessions, maybe all of the Saturday sessions, and turning them into very edited, for, for time constraints, videos to be put up on the channel here. And I say very, excuse me, I say very heavily edited for, for time because these sessions can easily run into seven hours on the Saturday games. I'll cut that down and just leave in the interesting bits. Because if you've ever played a tabletop role-playing game, you know that there are parts that are not particularly interesting <laughs> um, to an outside observer. But then, you know, there are things like character interactions with PC, NPCs rather, that uh, can get interesting, or combat can get interesting sometimes. Or sometimes there's just a, a humorous moment that just crops up out of nowhere, something spontaneous. And I'll leave those kind of things in, but there will be those boring moments and I'll cut those out so you don't have to deal with that. Other things, I play um, Armored Warfare, but um, every time I try to record it, it's not the best quality. Uh, it's not the recording quality that's the issue, is when I try to record, it takes the actual in-game quality down. Um, a noticeable amount so as soon as, until I can get that fixed I'm not going to be able to show any of that but I hopefully will be able to get that fixed soon I also play War Thunder but I'm I've been fighting with getting War Thunder to uh, work properly with my my HOTUS um, it has ever since I installed the game it hasn't been working properly with my HOTUS so I think there's something in the setup that I need to go in and I need to figure out what's going on with that so until that is taken care of which shouldn't take too terribly long uh, until that's fixed I won't be able to show you that but that's some things I want to show um, Armored Warfare, War Thunder, Minecraft, Pathfinder, um, things like that and I'll also try to record some things like card games and board games that I play occasionally with some of the people that I know and uh, we'll see how that goes. The last thing I want to talk about is the um, promotion of this channel. I need, I am going to start um, promoting it in many different ways. I'm going to go through a lot of different social media uh, avenues to try to promote this. I'm already promoting this on my Facebook, which it's my personal Facebook page, but I'm going to go out on a limb and I'm going to actually add my personal Facebook. <laughs> I'm cringing while I'm saying this. 
I'm going to add my personal Facebook page, uh, my, a link to it down in the description as well, as well as links to my other forms of social media so that you'll be able to find me on there. But what I would really appreciate is if anybody who is watching this could tell your friends about this. Um, tell your friends, share it on Facebook, share it on uh, whatever social media you're on, and uh, you know, draw, just kind of drag some more attention to it. Anything, any extra traffic that's brought to this channel by the people who are already watching this content would be greatly appreciated. And as time goes on, I'm going to be able to do more with this channel. Later on down the line, I'll be able to do things that will be a way of giving thanks to people who have supported this channel. There are a lot of different ways to support the channel, and all of them will be greatly appreciated. I'm going to be setting up things like a Patreon account and things like that for anybody who wants to donate. And any donations that are made are going to be going towards things like uh, upgrading equipment, buying better software, getting things that will make the channel better, improving the channel, because that's what this is about, is making things better. You know, continuing to put out content and putting out good content is making sure it stays enjoyable and stays new and, you know, just pushing it forward. So these are the kind of things that I'm looking forward to. And as time goes on, I'll be doing contests and uh, other things that people can submit their entries in and there will be some kind of uh, reward, some kind of prize at the end of the giveaway or at the end of the contest. I uh, don't want to call it a giveaway because I'm not just giving something away. It, it has to be won. It has to be earned. But it's not going to be something that's going to be ridiculous. The things that have to be done for these contests, they're not going to be completely impossible things. You know, it's, it, it, it's going to be challenging, but it's going to be fun at the same time. So, uh, lastly, on the topic of content, there's only so much that I can do by myself. So, if you have any replays of anything like World of Tanks, uh, War Thunder, um, Armored Warfare, anything like that, or you have something crazy that you've done on something like Minecraft, or, or anything, anything you think would be interesting along those lines to be shown, and you want it showcased, go ahead and submit it, and I'll put it on here. If you're just starting out like me, and you're trying to make a YouTube channel, we can work together to bring up awareness of each other. Uh, kind of a you scratch my back, I scratch yours. But even if it's not, you know, you just want other people, you think it's really cool and you want other people to see it. And you don't have a YouTube channel of your own and you don't plan on starting one just so other people can see these things. But you want other people to see these things. You want people to see oh, that awesome shot that you got on that one guy or this really cool thing that you built on Minecraft, something like that. If you want that to be shown, go ahead and submit it to me. Um, I'll put my email down in the description and you can email me the link. Email me the link to... Um, World of Tanks replays that you want shown, or uh, you can email me, not too large of, it, of files, but uh, go ahead and email me video files of things that you've done on Minecraft, or submit your replays for Armored Warfare or for War Thunder, and I'll go ahead and I'll put it up. I'll put my own commentary on it, and I'll put that video up, and I'll make sure that everybody knows, you know, who it is and what it is, and and everybody will get to enjoy it just as you did. That's about it for any kind of discussion that I have wanted to have with you this week. I hope that you continue to watch this channel. If you like any of the videos that you've seen here, go ahead and give them a like. Uh, that shows people that, you know, you, you saw it and you liked what you saw. And it, and it shows that you think it's quality stuff or at least entertaining. If you really like what you see here, if you've watched everything that I've put up so far and you really like what you see, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. You'll be able to keep track of everything that I put out. I'm going to be doing a World of Tanks video once a week. I try to get them out on Mondays uh, as long as I don't have technical difficulties or anything like that, like I had this week. If I don't get the video out on time, I'll probably do something like this again where you get some kind of bonus. Uh, could be something just where I'm talking to you like I am now, giving you updates on the status of things, or it could be something along the lines of just something funny, just just something 
to, to get a few laughs. I hope you enjoy this content. I hope you enjoy the direction that I plan on taking this channel. If you have any suggestions or anything that you would like to see, let me know down in the comments. I will read them and I will try to do anything that seems reasonable and seems to fit the theme that, that I want this channel to have. So until next week, take care of yourselves and I'll see you probably, I hope, on Monday.